What's up, cool people? My name's Matt. Welcome back to Earth Defense Force 2017. Okay, so, um, yeah. Mission 22 here seems like just a giant bag of interesting. I'm gonna try this rocket launcher here, uh, mostly on the big guys, and then for the, uh, for the ants, I'm gonna see about this new assault rifle. And... Select a mission. Select an initiating operation. Well, this is going just swimmingly. <sighs> okay. Select a difficulty before starting a level. Maybe a different weapon weapons. combo. You may um, two weapons at once. If it weren't for the getting caught up in the blast radius. Um, okay. Tell you what. I am thinking... Uh, 50 damage. Let me go with some of these, like, turret-type things, basically. And then... Maybe I'll try one of the shotguns, I don't know. See about maybe this shotgun. Ach. Select a stage. Select a difficulty. Initiating operation. It's honestly not terrible on damage, though. <laughs> Problem is, I have to get up real close. For it to really be effective like that. Yeah. Select a difficulty before starting a I don't think weapons. there's you may equip up to two a shotgun that has a much quicker reload time than that, other than this sparrow shot here, which does, I'm pretty sure, notably less damage per shot. Um, so, honestly, like, close range, this seems like the most effective weapon I have. Um, also, that was kind of terrible <laughs> for a long range option. Maybe I should just go with a sniper for the long range stuff. Um,. Uh, all right, we'll try. Select a stage. Select. We'll a try AR operation. and sniper, and um, <laughs> see if I can use the sniper to get rid of the one robot guy. Clear my path over this way. Oh, there's two robots over here. Okay, well, now I'm close enough that I can just hit him with this anyway. Okay, there's one down. I like some of the commentary here and there. It's like, I'm reloading, cover me. Other guy says, do it yourself. Yes, because clearly I can cover myself as I'm reloading. Really, I think the big robot guys are the major problem here. The only reason the ants are so annoying is because there's so many of them. But this... Assault rifle can dispose of them pretty quickly.
Okay, there's another robot down. Ooh, hello. This actually seems surprisingly open. Although that makes me wonder if it's just gonna be like a level barrier. If not, that could be quite helpful. Oh, great. Well, going out into deep water doesn't really help. Ouch. Honestly, even from not so close range, this AR isn't too terrible. Probably just because it's also fairly accurate. Yeah, great. And I'm back in the water. Okay, another giant robot down. Trying not to go for a swim here. I also find it kind of amusing how the giant robots will just, like, freak out <laughs> as you shoot them. Maybe, maybe it's supposed to be, like, messing with their targeting systems or something, I don't know. Holy cow, wait, am I, am I legitimately almost done with this? Or is this just going to be like, uh, alright, that was wave one sort of situation? Um, okay. Well, in case that's all, I'm going to uh, do some looting now. A little more health, because why not? But yeah, I don't really see an easy way, like, up the sides here to which I could have like attempt uh maybe that maybe up there's where I should have gone Just because the zoom helps me aim a bit better. Okay, but now I'm up close. Close enough that this is probably more effective. Wow, mission cleared. Okay, so once I figured out a decent enough strategy, that actually wasn't the worst. Ooh, hello. Got a new kind of sniper rifle. Select a difficulty before starting. Oh alone. man! The um, harder the difficulty you attempt, the stronger the weapons you will receive. Select a stage. <laughs> Great. Holes leading to the aliens' underground nest have been discovered inside the city. Giant bugs are pouring out of them. It appears the nest has expanded over time and now extends as far as the city. You are to head out there at once and take out those holes. Lovely! <laughs> um, and it's gonna involve the red ants this time. Great! Um,
Okay, um... Actually, you know what? Selected I might keep my current going into combat. equipment set. Health, yes, please. Oh, man, this is not going well. Ah. Um, okay. Select your weapons before deployment. You choose your weapons. You may equip up to two weapons at once. I definitely want something from range to try and, you know... Get some early damage to the holes, I guess, for lack of a better way to put it. Um... Let me try the rocket launcher. Select a stage. Select a different initiating operations. Ah, dang it. Bugs getting too close. Can't get good shot at hole. Actually, I think that hole's gone now. But still just too much. Too much! Didn't necessarily have a bad idea there, it just... I think maybe my path through the level wasn't exactly ideal. Second hole is over here. Huh. There's a helicopter. That makes me wonder. I know a bunch of the vehicles generally haven't been that great. But Oh, I gotta take a really long time to actually get this thing up in the air, though. Okay. Okay, the trigger's strafe. Okay, I'm a little too high now. Can we, like, not go up so high? Honestly, I, well, I don't know if nuking is quite the best term for this, but yeah, I'm pretty much thinking I just am gonna just sort of shoot down into here and problem is I can't seem to figure out how to actually go down to do any reasonable semblance of aiming. Okay. I think it's just sort of automatically slowing the uh, the blade or blades of the helicopter here. Oh! These seem to actually just be like straight up 
missiles with like homing and stuff okay oh am I out of is there a limit to the missiles because I can't seem to shoot those anymore great Well, that's lovely. There's a hole. Let's get rid of that. So yeah, helicopter. Not actually all that helpful. Um, where's the next? Where's the next hole? Gotta be another one not too far away, right? Aha! There's one. Although I'm noticing now, kind of sort of funneling the enemies between the buildings doesn't seem like a terrible strategy. At least to some effect. Then again, maybe it's not as effective a strategy as I would have hoped. Okay, there's that hole down. There's gotta be more though, right? Honestly, I have no idea the total number of holes in this mission and where all they're located. Okay, well that didn't go so great. Getting kind of stuck there for a second. Um... Might have to just get rid of a bunch of enemies first. Try and get things to settle down a bit. Before I then, you know, take a wider inventory of what all is left. There's a spider over there. Okay, now there seem to be a bunch of enemies somewhere behind me. Oh, come on! And with that many enemy dots coming from behind me, it means there's probably a hole over in that area. Possibly multiple. Can't seem to get a decent view of the hole in question, or holes in question. I was hoping to do so before actually getting attacked by the bugs, but I'm not so sure that's going to be an option here. What is the other vehicle that's available? <laughs> Maybe I should take a look at that. It seems to be kind of that way, but 
Or the, the hole seems to be kind of that way. Seriously though, what is the other vehicle over here? And is there potentially any health that has been left back this way? Yes, okay. That could definitely help a bit. I keep trying to roll to move around a bit faster, but sometimes I'm moving a little too straight, I guess, and it just has me jump instead. Okay, so it's saying there's a vehicle, like, right in here. What is this? Just looks like a speed bike kind of thing, basically. There's no... There's no weapons attached to it. Nothing. It just moves you around really fast. Which, I guess, could help with, like, trying to get away from a group of enemies, but smacking into buildings and stuff damages the bike. So, yeah, ultimately that doesn't seem to be particularly helpful. Alright, well... I've gotten my health back to max kind of regrouped. Is it really still regrouping if you're only one person? Okay, where's the hole? I've got to be getting kind of close to it, right? There's a bunch of red ants. Probably like on the other side of this ridge here or something. Alright, and that means I'm gonna have to probably put myself in danger in order to really get to the hole. Ugh! There's the hole. Okay. Hole is gone. And I'm hoping that's the one that was spawning the red ants, since there were a bunch of those really close to that hole. If that's the case, then I would hope the rest of this mission is going to get notably easier. due to the lack of red ants. Because while the black ants do have range, they don't do anywhere near as much damage per hit. Oh, and there's the, the black ant hole. So, I think that's pretty much it for the mission, other than just getting rid of whatever ants remain. Uh, I really don't think I'm going to want to go back through, like, everywhere on this map and loot, but I don't know. I want to try and at least pick up some other stuff.
Um, okay, you know what? Good enough. Mission cleared. Hooray! Uh, let's see here. Got another assault rifle. Just the base model AF-19. Would be better if it was like the AF-19 RA or whatever. The harder the difficulty you attempt, Cause that, the stronger the weapons you Because the RA variant weapons. is what I'm using right now. At once. Um, what's the next mission? mission? Oh, bunch of flying enemies. Fun. Received intel that a large Ravager unit is converging along the coast. Deploy your forces at once. You are to ambush and eliminate them. The EDF is currently planning a massive operation to infiltrate the alien's nest. We need to hit the enemy hard now to give us more time to plan for this operation. Hmm. Um. <clears throat> I might want to at least Please give this... Weapons. You Mission a look see. At once. Um, if we've got a bunch of the flying enemies involved, it's probably best if I use a missile. Um, so that's. Yeah, let me just try that out. And then. Not terrible rate of fire. Damage is quite a bit higher. Reload time isn't bad. And it's got a two times zoom. Hmm. Uh, has no outstanding strong point, but successfully improves on firepower without sacrificing overall performance. Great weapon with no particular disadvantages. Um. Yeah, let's try this combo out and see how Select it goes. Select a location to save your game. Select a dip select right. a mission. Select a difficult initiate but, uh, operation. Completed or not, I will definitely want to pause recording after this mission attempt. I feel like I'm using the vehicles as much for fun now as anything else. Uh, don't think I want it. Don't want want it. What do I not want enough? Exactly gives off the impression that I don't want to win there. Huh? I can't turn this thing around very well. <clears throat> okay, there's a bunch of walking arm dudes over this way. I kind of figured that was the case. Oh, jeez. Okay. And my vehicle mech thing just got destroyed. Lovely. You know what? Let me give this thing a whirl. Not too bad. If I could see anything. Dang. I am very much going to be expecting another wave in this mission, but just in case. Somebody cover me. 
I'm gonna go ahead and do some looting. But only a little bit. I'm not trying to make this take forever. This yep, there's another wave. The next wave of enemies are that figures. Oh, and now they've swapped places. The flying enemies are coming from inland, and the walking arms are coming from the coast. I could try and use a tank. But how helpful is that really going to be? Especially against these flying enemies that would probably move way too quickly for me to actually hit them with the tank. Well, I was definitely right to expect another wave of enemies. Now the only question remains, how many waves of enemies will, will there be? Okay. I can maybe do some damage with the tank now. That, uh, well, gotta fire it up a little bit higher if I'm going for long range. Ooh, I actually got a hit in there, I think. Hiya. Not quite. Yeah. The accuracy required is a little bit higher than I anticipated, though. Oh, come on. What's with trying to aim this thing? Okay, you know what? Really? This is not really doing much. Ah, dang it. I tried to hit him a little bit at the last second and, like, divert his attack, or its attack, and eh, whatever. I got two of them right up in there. One. Oh yeah. Well, that dropped like nothing but hell. Will there be a third wave in this mission? No. Huh. Okay. Might have tried to do a little more looting and stuff if I knew that was the case, but whatever. Think long and hard about which weapon Okay, select a mission. and there is still another mission at least. Um Yeah. I think I'm going to leave it at that for a second. Okay, so, couple missions in there, took a couple of tries, but it, it was quicker progress than last episode, for sure, and definitely more progress. Um, but yeah, I think the continued need to repeat missions is still a sign that, um, game's getting tougher. But anyway... As always, like and share if you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel, and click the bell if you're on YouTube to get updates when I post new videos, give me a follow if you see this on Rumble, and look down in the description for info on other social media pages and all that good stuff, and below that, leave comments with any thoughts you have.
So, that's going to do it for now. Hope you're all doing well. Hopefully, I'll see you for the next video. But until then, stay cool, people.